Before I start, I would like to explain a little bit about Proton. Proton is stand for uh, Perusahaan Automobile National Berhad. The main automobile company in Malaysia was incorporated in 1983 to manufacture and assembly and sell motor, vehicles, and related products. Proton has produced its first Malaysia car, and which is the Proton Saga model in year 1985 by the former Prime Minister that. To Sri Mahadir Muhammad. For my part, I need to explain about basic needs. For basic needs, we have three, which is a product quality where we need to improve the technology, design, and functions to gain back the customer confidence and then uh, offer good service to lower price. For example, by not use the same components or equipment as the car imports in terms of safety equipment. And then the customer value and satisfaction can define as the customer overall assessment of the utility product based on the perception what is received and what is given. Okay, next I would like to explain how these three can relate to each other. For product quality and customer value are important to achieve the competitive advantage and customer satisfaction. Well, nowadays, most customers are prefer good service to lead to lowest price. Uh, where the situations, as we can see, our customer are prepared to pay a little more to get a better or efficient okay. service. <laughs> customers are very uh, customers are requiring and demanding better service and the goals of the all automobile companies is to make customer feel special by improving service quality which will lead to the customer loyalty others it will also have a positive positive impact on customer satisfaction Assalamualaikum everybody my name is Muhammad Fatul Islam bin Ismail and today I will explain to you about drive to change Okay, a uh, drive to change is the shift done to increase the customer satisfactory. It has two types, uh, shift and trigger. Okay, shift is the long-term change that takes years or decades, like aging world and climate change. Okay. Trigger is immediate change, drive customer change. As example, technology, economy, and political. So today, I will explain drive to change of Proton. Okay, uh, Proton has a problem with quality control. By combining Proton G and GD, Proton can increase the quality of the product or the model. Okay. Due to GD have a technology of Volvo, also the new product of Proton were introduced, Saga Persona, that have the latest system of technology with the lowest price. Also, all of the new car were tested with various kind of tests to ensure it endurance through its usage and lastly Gili provide the quality program by adopting a system from Volvo that increase the market share about 10% okay uh, so as I can conclude that uh, by using the drive to change it can increase the uh, publicity of the product and also can change the system of the product which can make our quality become better and better. Okay. That's all for me. Thank you. Hello, my name is Indonesia. Today, I'm going to explain about how Proton, the Malaysia automobile company, understand the emerging customer expectation. Firstly, in automobile industry, the fuel efficiency technology has treated fast consumer to expect more powerful yet air efficient engine to meet fewer emission standards. So Proton introduced Campro engine in their car. Proton had launched Gen 2 with Campro engine as well as Proton uh, Waja and Proton Sata. In 2012, Proton introduced Campro charge fuel efficiency engine, which first introduced in the Visora Bolt and Visora Prime. This train satisfied the need and expectation of the customer. 
Besides that, the growing concern about protecting environment, manage carbon footprint and volatile petrol prices trigger customer and consumer to expect more electric and hybrid vehicles. Hence, Pluto started to develop its own electric and hybrid vehicle. In 2010, Pluto participated in the car challenge with the Saga EV and Exora Range, range Expander electric vehicle. Uh, Pluto achieved success at the challenge where the Exora Range Expander electric vehicle was awarded the best vehicle. Other than that, multi-purpose vehicle MPV train have triggered customer or consumer to expect infinite choices and smaller size of MPV. What Proton did was they introduced the first MPV car, the Proton Exora in 2009, which is quite large in size. So Proton keep on developing and launch MPV at smaller size that can accommodate many people, which is Proton, Proton MPV in 2016. So this proved that Proton understand emerging customer expectations. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Ras and Hidayah Binti and I will, I will be presenting you on the inspiration that we can adapt them to the Proton. Seeing what other business can do with this trend can, can be a great way to better understand it and gain inspiration. Most successful innovations come from taking something and, de and deploying it into a new context. The existing business innovation that in Malaysia, is Nada and Peroda. Peroda, which is also known as the Perusahaan Automobile Kudua Sunya Murhat, has been established in 1992. The set of car is economy car. Peroda do not design or engineer their car of main components such as engine and transmission. Their cars has historically used the Hudson main component. As you can see in the domestic sales, Perodua has been targeted to be the largest manufacturing cars in Southeast Asia. Myvi was the best selling car in 2006 to 2013, making it as eight consecutive years been the best selling cars in Malaysia. Car product and production for Perodua is Myvi, Alza, Visa, and the new super mini cars, which is. Three. The NASA group of companies has begun to establish NASA Motor Training Center in 1975 to import used and reconditioned cars in Malaysia by the late Tansuri SMM Sigurim SM Amin. But to this date, they have 14 business divisions such as four wheel, two wheel, and manufacturing. As we can see here, the NASA Automotive Manufacturing has produced NASA, Pujo, Kia, and Search More in DS. In Proton, they have tried to be partnership with the Search More in DS whereby the late Proton has expressed to not use Mitsubishi platform and to partner with the PSA Peugeot Citroen to access its diesel engine. And in, and in April 1996, the agreement has been built, has been made to build a Proton Tiara that used a Citroen engine. And next, we move to the NASA automotive manufacturing models. These are all the models that NASA has rebatched for the market in Malaysia, such as Nazaria. Nazaria is made from, is rebatched from Kia Carnival, Nazar Chitra, Kia Carens, and Nazar Sutra, Kia Picante. For my part, I will explain more about Proton innovation potential and who we are targeting to. Our innovation potential are mainly through our vision and uh, our new product. We also do several business models and campaign, but we chose to better our sales by focusing more towards our new product. We understand the current market demands new innovation in their car, but our consumer also are mainly below the middle part of the pyramid. So we have to adapt our product and create new model that not only affordable but also trendy. We so we have we have collaborated we with several other companies such as Mitsubishi. Citroen, Lotus, Youngman, Honda, and Suzuki. The earlier product in our company, like Saga and Vira, are the example of successful collaboration between Proton and Mitsubishi. In 2016, Proton then continues to see improvement 
by collaborating with Suzuki in order to obtain their expertise in specific technical issue as well as maintain their cost efficiency. Our main customer group target to our product is family because the majority of our product not only children and children friendly but also suitable to accommodate 5 people per car. We also targeting a work, working person as we provided the latest technology towards our product such as Bluetooth device connector and large boot storage to, for busy working person.